Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Uh, hello everyone, my name is Kayla Zeta Zafitri and I'm from BPI1 Senior High School and here I'm standing in front of you guys to deliver a speech of mine and uh, that is how most of people often think of how an introverted person speaks in public. Trembling, shy, nervous, anxious, well Having a perspective on the introverts are like opening up our phone and search up on Google what is the strongest animal in the world. Because we will never expect for a dung beetle to be on top of the list. Not tiger, nor gorillas, or any other bigger creature. It's just the same thing as we will never expect for an introvert to be up here in front of the camera, in front of you guys, delivering a speech. Or should I introduce myself to you guys? Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Kyla Zeta Zafitri and I am an introvert. Now, you guys must be wondering what are these personality thingy has to do with the word social, which is our theme of the day. Well, socializing is the main key to be a part of our society, correct? And without recognizing, our personality actually plays a big part in it too. Like for example, take a look at yourself when you're out in public, whether with your friends or your colleagues. Take a look at yourself. How did you act around them? Are you a more shy and quiet type of person? It means that you're an introvert. And if you are more like smiley and outgoing, it means that you're an extrovert. Well, yeah, that is just one basically. But the actual question of the day is, are we always what we label ourselves? When I was a child, I've always been that one kid who only got like one or two friends, sits in the corner of the class and and I never bothered to socialize with my friends. Because I thought, why would I bother myself to get up and start talking with my friends 24-7 non-stop? That would be just so tiring and such a waste of time, right? And that's what I thought until high school life came to me where everybody said it is the best era of our youth. It's the golden age of our life. And I want mine to be that way too. I want my high school years to be filled with a lot of fun, sweet memories with my friends, and you know, I just want to celebrate my 17th birthday with them. But now I have reached those goals. I have collected a lot of sweet memories with my friends, a lot of, like, you know, memories with my friends, you know. And I, I have celebrated my 17th birthday with them. So yeah, what I'm trying to tell you guys is if you have the same kind of social issue as mine, is find your own inspiration and make your own unique way to deal with. Because here's the thing, if we can't even handle our own social issue, then who's going to handle with the world's social issue? So yeah, I will quote one thing before I end my speech. Please always remember that it is much more powerful for us to be able to do our best in all of our imperfections rather than just being perfect. Well, that is all in my speech, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you for your time. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.